Hi, this is Trent with Metageek, and in this video I would like to talk about the three different types of multi-layered pie charts in IPA. The first one is in the left, and it's called bytes. And this is the total amount of bytes that were sent in a particular SSID or by client or frame type. The other multi-layered pie chart is packets. The time represents the total amount of airtime that each packet had to take. It is not representative of any free time or air time that is not being utilized. This is the total amount of time it took to send a particular frame. As I hover over the beacon subframe type, you will see that it'll also highlight the same slice in the bytes in the packets windows. But let's move over to the bytes and we'll hover over the, the beacons again. Now you notice that the multi-layered pie chart has changed drastically. And the reason this is is because the AP will beacon at the lowest data rate possible. So once we look at the uh, the broadcast piece, we can see that all of the traffic that was management beacon frames was sent at the lowest data rate possible. That's one megabits per second. And it took up a significant amount of airtime by looking at the multi-layer pie chart in the in the top left. However, this little tiny slice that I'm hovering, o hovering over right now, we can see that the bytes are disproportionate. And this is because the bytes were sent at a higher data rate. It was sent at 48.8 megabits per second. Now, in terms of airtime, this is a very, very small slice of time that it took to send a larger amount of data. Looking at the time multi-layer pie chart, we can see that when you have enabled legacy data rates like one megabit per second, you take up a lot of air time when you could be allotting it to faster data rates like this client who was able to connect at a data rate of 48.8 megabits per second. This is just a quick overview of how the different views in IPA are very specific to wireless packets, and I hope you learned a lot from this video. Thanks for watching.